All right, everybody, it is time to get out our heavy knit sweaters, our cashmeres and our wools, and start putting them away for the warmer months. Now, what I like to do is get things out of sight and out of mind. I did this this weekend in under 30 minutes. Miles says hello back there behind the sweaters. And um, it just helps your closet feel fresh and new, and it makes way for spring and summer pieces that you can bust out and those lightweight sweaters. So before we decide to put our wools, cashmere's, heavier knit sweaters away, there's a couple things that we wanna do to ensure that when you bust them out again, that they're still in really good condition. So you wanna make a couple piles. First, go into your closet, pull them out, set them aside so you can see them in nice light. Because what you notice is when you start looking at them in actual lighting, where it's near natural light, you'll start to see a little bit more imperfections. So you're gonna make some categories. You're gonna make a dry cleaning pile, a hand wash pile, or maybe the dry cleaning we don't do, so just all hand wash pile, or machine wash. So for this sweater, for example, I'm gonna take a look at it. It has some um, kind of wear. It's a little bit dirty on the sleeve. So I'm probably going to take this and either hand wash it or decide to, to dry clean it, whichever one is most convenient for me at the moment. And I've got my piles created for sweaters that are all clean. Once they've gone through the cleaning process, I'm going to take a few things that are going to help to keep my sweaters fresh before I store them away. And I usually store them in a container that is a nice hard plastic container with a lid that's tight sealed so that if I store it away for up to six months, perhaps in San Diego, that when I bust them out again, they're still going to be in really great condition. So nice tight fitting lid container. Also, again, you can find those on Amazon. I'll link everything here for you. And with my labeler, I will normally create a nice label for my lid because once I store this away, <laughs> I will not remember what is in it um, unless it is maybe in my like top of my closet area. I'm going to probably store these downstairs in either another room or the garage. So having, again, that tight fitting lid and having it be labeled keeps everything in the top of mind when I'm busting them out again. Okay, so sweaters are all clean. We're ready to fold them up and put them away. Before we do that, I like to, in the bins, put either a lavender little sachet or some sort of cedar. Both of these things are natural moth repellents and they'll also help make your clothes smell just a little bit better when you pull them out after being there for up to six months. Or I also like to use a little spritz of a sort of fabric spray, I guess you could say. Um, this just, again, helps it freshen up a little bit. And I basically hold it a few inches away from the sweater, just give one little spray, and then I can fold up my sweater and put the, it away into the bin. For the really heavy knit fabrics, I find that kind of have those pill problems, which most of us can get. You might not be able to see it fully, but there are de there's definitely some pilling on this sweater. If I want to, and I normally do on most of those sweaters that need the, the pilling, the deep depilling, I should say, I just kind of run my depiller along my sweater. You can kind of hear it working there. Just run it up and down, get rid of those bigger pills. And again, that freshens up and readies my sweater. So when I bust them out in the fall, I can just put them on. So I'm gonna take all those sweaters, I usually will, Go one step farther and maybe color coordinate like the darker sweaters the grays and the blacks and then maybe neutral sweaters put them in one bin and then maybe all of my colorful printed sweaters might go in a second you can just put them all together but the idea is that at the end you have all of your heavier sweaters that are all nice and folded cleaned and deep hilled that are ready to be put away and lidded and so that you've got room in your closet for all of your spring pieces. I hope that helps. Everything's linked below. Let me know if you have any questions and go get to putting away your heavier sweaters.